Hey my pretties, welcome back. So today's video is going to be a haul. I've been talking about this haul <laughs> in a lot of my other videos. Um, I'm like, I got a haul, I got a film for you guys and I just had not did it yet. Um, I actually have to, I'm only, I broke this in half because I wanted to keep stuff separate. So after you watch this one, stay tuned for the next haul because I have some more Christmas items. Um, so that's what we're doing today. In this haul, I wanted to share, I think, more of like the beauty stuff and the clothing and whatever else I found. And then in the next haul, I only picked up a couple more Christmas items, which I'm trying to be good this year. Like last year and the year before, I was picking up a lot of stuff. Um, this year, not so much, but we'll talk about that in that video. Uh, but so with this one, we're going to go ahead and get started. I have items from, ooh, Torrid. Target. Oh, I'm so excited to share with you guys two pieces. Oh, look, I'm holding up one finger. <laughs> two pieces from specifically from Converse. I want to start with that first, but I'm not. And Betsy Johnson. But I'll save that for the middle of the video to make sure you guys stay tuned to keep watching. So Lord, let's go ahead and jump into this haul. So the first item from Target was the Dr. Teal's, the gingerbread scented Epsom salt. Y'all knew I was going to get this. And this is already like my fourth bag. I only bring one down to share with you guys. Um, I love the scent of gingerbread. I love the ones from last year. The, was it sweet vanilla or van cozy vanilla cashmere? Whatever. The sugar cookie. They have different ones. I've tried all of them. And I like the sugar cookie and the warm vanilla. But I think right now my favorite is gingerbread. I mean, I just love the scent on this one so I got a few of these. I also snagged all three of the Dove new scents. There was more scents at Walmart so I guess each store gets exclusive um, scents that only they get so I did show you guys the ones from Walmart cannot remember chai latte and what it, peppermint bark and whatever the other one is. Um, those are at Walmart so Target got gingerbread delight which I showered with one of these last night. <laughs> Love it. And I did get the hot cocoa swirl. I picked this one up for my daughter. She likes the hot cocoa scent. I don't like the scent. I mean, I like it, but I don't really like the scent on the scrub because there's a scrub that goes with this as well. Don't really care for the scent, but my daughter likes this one. And then the fr uh, frosted plumberry. I love that. It's really, well, not really sweet, but it has this sweet, like, berry kind of scent to it that I really like. So, I did get all three of those. So, from the Tree Hut line, all I got was the Peppermint Pearl Foaming Gel Wash. Uh, I didn't want to get any of the other ones. The, what is it, Amethyst, Topaz, all the other gems and stuff like that. Um, I just wanted the peppermint because I love me a peppermint scent. Whether it's lotion, body butters, body wash all of that I love peppermint during the holiday season it just I don't know and then not only does it make you smell good but it brightens up the whole bathroom like the bathroom just has this like sweet scent I just love it so I did get this and then I also from beloved got the peppermint and sugarcane scent and for that reason again with the peppermint I love peppermint um I just do <laughs> So I did get this and this smells really good. I like it. It doesn't last long. It's not like a lasting scent. You can pair it with something else that's peppermint. Like I would use my, um, cause I use the, uh, Hemp's peppermint body lotion. I'll put on my body lotion and then I'll pair it with this and it just, it'll last a little longer. So yeah, I got this one. So this came from Walmart and it's the Scent Theory Scents of the Season and it's Gingerbread Woods. If you guys see me in Walmart, you saw me have the guy get this down because I needed this and it was $10. It comes with a Gingerbread Woods room spray, a candle, and a bubble bath type of little deal right there. So haven't opened it, have not smelled it yet, but I mean, it's gingerbread, it's gingerbread, so. So you can scratch it right here to smell it and it smells really nice. And so that was another item that I had to have. So I told you guys in another video that when it starts to rain, I like to wear my clear 
uh, Ugg boot rain boots when I wear those I like to wear like festive socks that you because you can see through the boot right <laughs> and most likely I'll wear like leggings that way the pant the sock can come up the leg and you can see it and it's just like a whole little vibe right so I chose these from Target to go uh, with my clear boots and you'll see this part on my leg and you know, so I just thought those would be cute I did get this baking spirits bright with the gingerbread. Of course. I have to have these so you'll be able to see The house and stuff through the shoe or whatnot And then I did get this set as well. These were the shorter ones. I didn't mean to pick this up I wanted the long ones So I'll probably just wear these around the house when I go back to Target. I'll get this one in this length, but I did get these with the little nutcracker guy and the peppermint socks. Okay, now these I showed you during a walkthrough and it's these were from the men's section. Um, well, they were labeled under men's. I still have not seen this one in women's, um, but I got me a pair. <laughs> and it's the cute little pajamas with the gingerbread houses. Let me see, you get a better picture. You got the gingerbread house, you got that one. There's a wreath. A bear there's a bunch of cute little stuff on here cookie snowflakes and that little guy right there and they have the dolls to match this too so this was oh I forgot how much this was how much was this 20 30 20 20 I think it was 20 <laughs> but um yeah this is part of their you know family sleep set so you can get matching pajamas for everybody also from target i did get one of the squishmallows i have to i love the i love target <laughs> if walmart came out with one i would get one if tj maxx had a doll a uh, squishmallow i get that too um you know i just thought he was cute and then last year i did get the bullseye playground dog um which i still have so i have both of these and um yeah i had to get him i think he's really fun and squishy and then speaking of target i chose to get the little people target <laughs> little setup right here cute super cute i don't know i don't know uh even pooh bear he said mom that's really cute i like the poly pocket one too i showed that to you guys in a different in a shorts or in a different video they have a poly pocket with the big bullseye dog face on the front of the little case but this one right here um I just thought it was too fun the little dog you got the car you got him the employee you got the baby in the cart <laughs> there's a basket at the register and just super cute and a little fun fact I have a couple little people um, that I kind of collect like I have the set that's salt and pepper I have um, run DMC and just a few other ones that are not that common to get so i started to get the one from aldi when i filmed there last week the little christmas set i started to get that but i didn't um but i ended up with the target one and so any of these items if i can i will link them down below in case you want one <laughs> yeah so i did get that gotta love the sequin house shoes oh my goodness i like sequins when it comes to like christmas and all of that all this as you can tell, I love me some sequins. I think they are just beautiful. It's the, the, the shine. Like, I don't know. It's something about um, November and December, you'll see me wearing sequins kind of often. <laughs> so I had to get these. I was torn between the black and the, or the red ones, but I had to get black. So I got these also from Target. And speaking of sequins, these are not sequins, but they are sparkly. And it was the little boots from Target. These are Wild Fable, and they just look like that. And I thought these would be really, really cute to wear, you know, with your jeans, covering it. I don't like that they're really short like this. I wish they were a little bit longer, but I've already tried them on with a pair of jeans, and you know how the jeans kind of fall over the top. You don't even know that they're short, but you do see all the sparkle, um, you know, so I like these. I think they're nice and when I put them on they were super comfortable they do have the sorry for all that noise they do have the Sherpa on the inside they have the zipper right there and um, yeah I just thought these were pretty cool these were $40 but as you know lately especially around the holidays Target will do their deals where it's like 30% off of clothing and shoes they've been doing that lately 
So make sure you pay attention to that if you are interested in anything that I'm showing you. But yeah, these were 40. Okay, these I got from uh, Macy's Backstage and they're just these like slippers like that. I love the gray and I love the detail right here. Um, I wasn't sure if I was gonna keep these for myself or give these to one of my sisters. I'm still not sure yet, but however, I did pick these up and they were $15 at Macy's Backstage and they're just Jessica Simpsons, but you can find these everywhere. Ross, Target, Marshalls, I mean not Target, TJ Maxx, Marshalls, Burlington. These are everywhere, but I like the gray. Okay, so I have a jacket and a robe that I'm gonna share with you guys at the very end. I have to show you, I have to show you my favorite things that I have purchased is two, the two items that I talked about. I have to show them to you right now. <laughs> we'll get to the robe and the jacket. The jacket is pretty too, that came from Target. But um, let's get into this, let's get into this. So I'm gonna show you the box. And you guys know I love me some shoes. You know that's my jam, right? So look at the box, it's a hint. These are Converse limited edition and I'm trying to show them to you soon so that I can link these just in case any of you guys want to get these look at that okay that's the bottom so you can uh cut these little pieces they got the lines on it so you can cut them out so I already took the shoe out but that's the box you guys ready for this are you ready I don't know if y'all ready because I wasn't ready <sighs> take a deep breath look at this shoe Look at my gingerbread Converse. <laughs> they are adorable. Look at him. And he even has a Converse tag on him. So he wasn't just crocheted. He was like crocheted specifically for Converse. So he has that. You got him running away. And these also came in red. I could not decide which ones I wanted. I'm happy I got the forest like green. But you have him running away. You got the fat laces. Oh yeah. Love me some Converse too. So you got the brown stripe up the back. Even the uh, tag right here is brown. And look at the wreath on the inside right there cute if tennis shoes and stuff like that converse is not your thing then you know you might not like these but honey <laughs> i had to have these oh my goodness and he is so cute you can take him off if you want i would never do that um but he is hooked on with like a little like like a string or whatever and he's laced through the laces right here so he can come off if you choose to um I will keep him on there. The other shoe doesn't have him. So you only get one gingerbread man. So yeah, only one side will have him, but the other shoe has this one and the wreath as well. And like I said, they come in red. I had to have these shoes. Okay, now you think I'm excited by these? Let me show you the next item. <sighs> Betsy, Betsy. Betsy, can we get it? Can we give a, a a moment of silence for that big old red bow on the top of my tree, right there? I wasn't gonna put that there. My daughter insisted. I did have a pink bow as well. I started to do the pink bow, but it didn't pop as much. I have a pink sparkly uh, uh, sequin bow that you guys know. Those bows came from Burlington, but I started not to do that. But she said it kind of it makes it all pop. So I just put it there. You see the gingerbread tree over there. Hey. Um, yeah, I don't know. I'm still in the middle of kind of doing some things right here. But I don't know. What you guys think? Just tell me in the comments yes or no to that red bow. I'm kind of on the fence with that one. But if I take it down, I don't know what I'm going to do because I didn't really like the pink one on there either. Maybe I just won't have a bow. Let me know down below. As you can see, you know, it's, it's very, very bold. <laughs> okay, back to this. Betsy Johnson she always do her thing when it comes to jewelry and all of the things sparkly y'all I think y'all y'all know if y'all seen this you knew I was gonna get it I had to get it look at this bag look at the bag she got the lips is sparkly I haven't even taken the paper off the bow hold on look at that she has a little bite mark on the leg right here. 
Oh my goodness. This is more like a statement piece bag. Um, the back looks like that. Very pretty metallic brown. Oh, I love that. Oh, this is so pretty. Now, you get the little heart tag and it looks like a candy cane. And so, this is more like a novelty type bag. Um, you can put stuff in here, of course. But for me, like, it's not like I'm going to carry my whole wallet, my camera, my phone. Maybe my phone, maybe some money, maybe some lip gloss or something. And I just wear it for the day, you know, when I'm out and about or whatever. And I might just be taking the kids to the mall or something. Just throw my debit card, some money, my phone in there, and that's it. This ain't a carry-all bag. But she is adorable. <laughs> and that is the strap on it. It looks like that at uh, closer to the bag and then it turns into the metallic color right there. Oh, she's so cute. And um, I can't remember. There's a few places selling this. I think Dillard's. I purchased mine from the actual Betsy Johnson website. That's usually where I get my stuff at. Um, yeah, so that's where I got mine's at. Again, I will link her down below. Hopefully she's still available because I'm sure she was going to go fast. So cute look at her something that i'll have for many years and then maybe one day my daughter will take it <laughs> so i got her when i did my tour video you guys probably already know that's where this shirt came from i showed this in the walkthrough when i was there and then i also picked up the leggings that look like gingerbread and just some regular leggings that have the gingerbread men all over it with the candy canes and all that and it says oh snap so for me i'll wear these and then i have a brown cardigan and i'll put on like a white shirt with my brown cardigan my leggings and then i'll wear like maybe some black boots or like a combat boots or something like that i don't know but i had to have these and i don't normally wear character leggings they kind of i just don't but because i'll wear like a long cardigan over these <laughs> I figured let me get these so these came from Tor uh, Torrit and before I show you the jacket and the robe and then we'll be done I forgot to sh I forgot these were on the side I did end up getting the little Stanley uh, cups the little ornaments or keychain um, I don't know I just got them uh, I didn't buy any of the cups or anything like that I have enough I have a couple Stanley cups so I was like mm -mm. it'd be the colors the colors get me make me want to get it I really would have wanted that wicked one the green one um, but I was not about to be in nobody's store fighting and I never seen them online if they did they sold out super fast but I did get these uh, you can hang these on your purse you can put them on your keys or you can put them on a tree it doesn't matter but yeah I chose two of these from Target I think they're still available of course, if they are, they'll be linked below. Okay, let me show you guys this robe and this jacket. So, one of my other loves um, besides Betsy Johnson is Kate Spade. She has the cutest holiday bags and stuff. Um, yeah, I like Kate Spade stuff. I always have, even when she was still living. I loved her stuff. It go, We go way back. <laughs> <laughs> so when I see her stuff in like Marshalls and TJ Maxx and stuff, when it's a, like the prices is like, man, cause you know, her stuff was expensive. So I saw this pretty pink and red Kate Spade robe and I happened to get it in an extra large. I'm like, I'm getting that. Um, it was only $30. This robe probably retailed for like 130, 140, somewhere like that. And it's just a regular basic robe, nothing fancy, but I love the pink and the red. So yeah, and this came from Marshalls and um, yeah, it has the belt of course. And yeah, so my Kate Spade robe. Oh yeah, before I get to the jacket, there was this jacket that I forgot that I had. And this was also from Macy's Backstage. I showed you guys this one, I said I was getting it. And it was the zip up jacket with the candy cane on the front and the gingerbread man on the back i could even wear these with my leggings if i choose to but yeah this came from macy's and just so you guys know this was 15 dollars. aren't they cute and the last item came from target it's universal thread and i'm not gonna lie when i seen it i'm thinking to myself gingerbread <laughs> a life a life-size gingerbread girl <laughs> i got the brown sherpa jacket this one yeah it was 55 it was 55 but it is so cute 
So this is what it looks like. It only has a one button closure right here. So, you know, you fold it over right there. There is no belt, but tell me the top is just, that is so cute. Let me see. So it fits really nice. You do have the front pockets right here. Sorry, you can't see the whole length of it. It goes to my knees because of course I am 5'4". Nothing fancy about the bottom or anything. Just a regular, just a regular jacket. It's, it's the top for me. It's all of this right here that got me and it fits really really nice like I don't have it buttoned so that's why I keep tugging on it but this is what it would look like if I was out doing some Christmas shopping <laughs> I think that's really pretty now I always I usually say hold on what I was saying was I usually I don't usually buy like real big heavy jackets because it just doesn't really get that cold in Ca not to me in California like even at nighttime well sometimes lately it's been getting cold at night so this will be perfect, but I hate to wear a heavy piece like this. And then like, say I am in the mall and I'm shopping and I'm moving around and I'm walking, I get hot. <laughs> so it's like a catch 22. It's like, it looks cute. It's nice and heavy if I'm standing outside, but when I'm out shopping, I'll get hot. So I normally don't buy too many heavy jackets, but I love the color on this. And yeah, it was for a good price. So I did get this jacket and um that is it that is it for this haul so um i hope you enjoyed this like i said i think i put the camera up too high is that where we was at i think so okay <laughs> i hope you enjoyed this video again if i can link anything i will it will be down below um yeah maybe i gave you some ideas for some gifts for somebody in your family or some it's time to think about that so yeah i'm gonna wrap this video up and then uh i will make sure to have my next haul up pretty soon so you guys can see that as well okay i thank you guys for watching if you're new hit that subscribe button stick around i love for you too and i will see you all real soon in my next video okay bye you guys